everyone and how are you today? As I'm talking right now, it's March 19, Thursday, 2020 and I am in New York City. So I am officially staying home. So you might be in my situation, you might be laid off of work, you might work from home, you might still have to go to your job. This video is for the people who are bored, staying home, not finding things, what to do with your free time. I came up with seven ideas of what to do in your free time at home and not get bored and take care of your mental health and still have fun. I hope while you watch this you are safe and healthy and please take this situation with COVID-19 very serious because it is really serious and if it didn't come in your uh, country or state yet in my camp in New York City we have more cases it's a big city too so it's affected so it's important to work together and remember that we are in this together so for my seven ideas on how to not get bored while staying home i'm gonna have seven different lipsticks so for each of the ideas i'm gonna have one lip look if you're curious please keep on watching and if you want more ideas like this please consider subscribing and ringing the bell so you'll be notified when i'm gonna post new videos let's get started idea number one for idea number one, I'm gonna start by putting this Artiste Rouge Matte Lipstick. This is from Makeup Forever and this is a very beautiful nude that I have. So I like very much this lipstick because it's a very nice uh, nude for neutral and medium skin tones. It's more on the rosy side. Because it's the first one or it's the last one, that doesn't matter for the importance of these ideas. Or So my first idea it will be to exercise. So exercising I think it's very important because it's also stimulating the release of endorphins and that will make you more happy, it will improve your mood. So either you do aerobic, either you have a couple of weights at home or literally just improvise. If you don't have like a, how you say, a sport mattress, just put a towel. You don't really need like sport outfit, so you can just exercise in pyjama, why not? Dance on your favorite music, explore your body and do exercise 20 to 30 minutes a day. I think it will be enough to boost your mood. Idea number two. For idea number two, I'm gonna use the Yelma Cash with Carly Bible collaboration. So I have here the shade Libra and there is again this uh, nude beige lipstick. And this is more like on the warm side and I'm also gonna use the lip glaze in the shade Star Child. So for idea number two, I'm gonna suggest you to actually cook. So I live in USA and I feel like a lot of people around me, they don't know how to cook. So maybe this is a good way to actually learn how to cook a couple of basic things like make an omelet, make a sandwich, make a soup, why not? There are so many recipes on YouTube that they can tell you like step by step on how to cook certain things. And not only on YouTube, but there are a lot of blogs out there who can really teach you how to do certain stuff. And you don't have to uh, use 100% all the ingredients that they use there. Of course, some of them are essentials, but try to improvise and experiment. I think here in New York City, you can still order food uh, to take out or pick up, but I feel like that can be a little bit expensive. So it depends what's your budget too. Plus, I think for me personally, when I eat something that I cook, it just makes me feel so good and so proud about myself. For number three, I'm gonna go with this lippy sticks from Colourpop. This is in the shade Gold Digger and this is one of my favorite. I think the shade is so beautiful. Ooh. 
this looks so intense for number three and the color pop lip sticks i'm gonna suggest you to talk with your friends video call them reconnect with your family with maybe your cousins that you don't talk very often they are maybe in the same situation as you are and see if they are healthy safe maybe they are a little bit more depressed try to make a joke try to be supportive because we all are in this together so maybe not just like call them to hear them but actually use your phone so you can see them too because i'm only seeing my husband in my apartment and maybe i want to see some other faces too you know number four clean your house and I'm gonna use from Fenty Beauty. I have the Mini Mademoiselle lipstick and this is in the shade Flamingo Acid. I think it's important to have a clean environment especially when we're staying so much home so maybe beside the basic cleaning like uh, cleaning the dust organizing your clothes washing dishes vacuum and mop the floors maybe you can go a little bit extra and actually clean the fridge uh, scrub your bathroom and clean every little corner uh, move the sofa so you can clean under the sofa as well organize the whole closet uh, reorganize your socks underwear see what you are not wearing put them on the side to donate them or resell them you know uh, clean the window clean the stove inside and outside I just reorganized my makeup collection I throw away what was expired or almost expired so it feels very nice I think it can really improve your mood to stay in an organized and clean house for number five I'm gonna use the Too Faced peach collection and this is the shade chill peel okay oh. this smells so good For number five, well, my makeup is, my makeup is about channel. <laughs> my YouTube channel, it's about makeup. So maybe you're here because you are interested in makeup. Maybe you are a makeup lover or an aspiring makeup artist. Assume that you are interested in makeup. So now is the right time to get a little bit creative. Even if you're not getting out of the house, that doesn't stop you in doing your makeup. Maybe, I don't know, once in three days. Do your makeup and try new things. Be creative. You wanna do that winged eyeliner, get it to the extreme. You wanna try that crazy pink, eyeshadow that you never try and it's right there and you're just so afraid to try it try it now your co-workers might be your pets they won't judge you for that so experiment a little bit with makeup and not just only with makeup maybe now it's a good time to learn how to do your own nails like do your own manicure do your own pedicure do different hairstyles now you want to maybe try to do those curls that you always wanted to do but you didn't have the time so i actually have a tutorial on how to create this braid play a little bit with your look and experiment without feeling awkward to go out like this number six for number six I'm gonna go with L'Oreal Rouge signature in the shade I decide For number six, I can definitely suggest you to read a book or watch movies. So if you have some books out there that they are really waiting for you to open them, that you are curious and you bought them because you wanted to read them, now is the right time to do that. Or if you have a list of movies that you want to watch, just watch them. Or you can watch your favorite YouTubers, you can watch all their episodes. There are also books online that you can read and also podcasts that you can listen to. So I'm assuming that if you're watching this video, you have access to internet. So internet can really offer you a lot of good things if you just know 
the right way to use it. And maybe you have a favorite actress or an actor that you want to watch all your movies. So yeah, definitely do that. And number seven, I use the MAC Retro Matte Lipstick in the shade Ruby Woo. And this is a beautiful classic red. So we can close this video in all this glory. This is intense. And number seven and the last idea that I have for you to not get bored, it will be to develop a new hobby or relearn something that you were passionate when you were younger or a kid. So if you have a guitar home or an instrument, maybe now it's a good time to practice. Maybe you wanna play chess, uh, Monopoly, or types of board games. Maybe you wanna learn how to cook and that can be transformed into a hobby. Maybe you wanna learn how to edit photos and videos. Maybe you want to go online and learn how to do new things like coding, editing, things that you can do at home and work on yourself. Maybe exercising can become a hobby. Maybe you want to film your cats and put them on TikTok. So whatever you think will make you happy and give you some joy, just do that. Enjoy the time with yourself, enjoy the time with your partner, and pretty much that's it. As a bonus, if you have pets, cats, dogs, parrots, <laughs> play with them, groom them. I think pets are so relaxing to play with them and laugh and I always spend such a good time with my cats. I have two cats, I adopted them and they are just so beautiful and so like well behaved and I'm so grateful to have them in my life. That's a bonus if you have a pet, if you don't have a pet, well, watch other pets on the internet i think they're fun too that was it for today guys and please let me know in a comment down below what are the things that now you are doing while staying home please let me know in a comment down below give me some ideas we can all share ideas i think it's important to communicate and i hope we can go through this together and let's not let the fear overwhelm us let's be alert not anxious let's keep in touch with the news but sometimes take a break from them i just wish you all the best and i'm gonna be here still posting on my channel and thank you very much for watching please consider subscribing and see you next time bye